Hey guys, I'm on the other side of Franklin Wall. Looks like we got the Bend Chamber of Commerce. 777 North Northwest Wall. We got all these things in here. We got wow. A bunch of different things. It'd be a lot of places and offices to visit if I were to ever come into this building and check it out. Let's see. A4 and B6. Old Post Office. National Register of Historic Places. Construction of the Old Post Office established the presence of the federal government in this area. It was a project of the Public Buildings Program, a federal agency created by President Herbert Hoover. As one of the first buildings with reinforced concrete in Bend, the old post office is characteristic of the architectural detailing popular in the 1930s, built 1932. This heritage walk plaque was donated in memory of Chuck Overbay U.S. Forest Service. Huh. Okay, more of those juniper berries, very poisonous, do not eat those. Are you sure those are juniper berries? Uh, I don't think they are. But, but it is some form of uh, poisonous berry of some form that I can't really... Oh, yeah. it's definitely not juniper. Okay, it's okay. It's just informed these aren't, aren't juniper berries, but... Better safe than sorry, do not eat those. Okay. Crab apple tree. Crab apples are otherwise okay to eat. Okay. But, but they are very bitter and sour though. I'll keep that in mind. Mm -hmm. Got the post office box right there. Yeah, this is quite the building. A lot of really detailed architecture. United States Post Office. Yeah, it was an old post office building. And I don't think I should go in there right now. Alrighty, so this is downtown Bend. Pretty nice city. Well, glory and probably the Oregon State flag underneath it. Wall Street Plaza and the sign is empty. Okay. City of Bend, Growth Management Department, Economic Development. Okay. Nothing for me. Let's see. City of Bend, Information Technology, City Staff Only. Okay. City of Bend, Engineering and Infrastructure Planning Department. Lansdowne Conference Room. Huh. Okay, we got that. Let's see, now we're at Wall in Louisiana. Yeah, and we're approaching the public library. Okay. Let's see. All right. Well, we got something over here by the flags. So let's see what we got. Okay, honoring all veterans who served our nation. Presented to Ben Public Library by Veterans of Foreign Wars of the United States, post 1643, Bend, Oregon, November 10th, 2005. Huh. That's nice. Okay, back here more stable footing, get you guys a shot up there, 
it's no wind right now so they're not flapping in the breeze but yeah Central Oregon red fire hydrant and let's see Bob and Yvette Chandler family north garden huh okay, what we got here C2 the Hippodrome one of Ben's leading entertainment centers from 1916 to 1941 was the large brick Hippodrome the Hippodrome was primarily a dance hall and skating rink, first owned by a Portland merchant. Local author and musician Paul Hosmer, for whom Hosmer Lake is named, and his dance band were fixtures of, at the Hippodrome, where admission to dances in the 1920s was a dollar per person. Under the ownership of a local billiard parlor operator Charles Nickel. The Hippodrome continued operation until it was purchased by the Safeway Corporation which raised the building and constructed a new store that opened May 15, 1942. Built 1904. This heritage wall plaque or heritage walk plaque was donated by the Deschutes Public Library. Huh. Okay. So here we got let's see continual growth or can no excuse me continual is the journey past sunset toward morning Willis Eberman huh okay Access to knowledge is the superb, the supreme act of truly great civilizations. Toni Morrison. Huh. Okay. The storyteller is the person who creates an atmosphere in which wisdom reveals itself. Barry Lepez. Huh. Okay. And we have the Deschutes Public Library. Alright, let's walk over here and get the rest of these quotes. Okay. Liberty cannot be preserved without the general without a general knowledge among people uh, John, Adams. John Adams huh okay okay and yeah I can barely even read that one they need to trim the tree and I can probably get this one a little better yep can you and I can turn and look at the silent river and wait. What the river says, that's what I say. William Stafford. Huh. Okay. All right, well. I've waited for the bus at this stop numerous times. But of course, the last time I did, only the two stopped here. Now you can see the 10 also stops here. Okay, but here we got these fish. Which is pretty cool. And the plaque says, Salmon Dance, Wayne Chamber. Donated by the Ben Foundation. Selected by Art and Public Places 2001. These fish look cool. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Got a lot of detail, especially in the water and all that. Oh, it's really cool. Huh. 
Okay, well, standing in front of the Deschutes Public Library on Wall Street, downtown Bend, this is High Desert Observer. I'm just out here looking.